Bole Gunner Solskjaer is entitled to a £7.5 million severance package. Manchester United will be forced to fork out £7.5 million if they finally take the plunge and sack Ole Gunnar Solskjaer now, according to reports. The Red Devils have reportedly decided to sack the Norwegian after holding an emergency board meeting in the wake of their humiliating 4-1 defeat at Watford on Saturday. It was United's fifth Premier League defeat in their last seven outings, with rivals Liverpool and Manchester City both easily swatting the Old Trafford outfit aside in recent weeks too. But the Sun claim should the club bow to the ever-increasing pressure and confirm they will sever ties with the 48-year-old mid-season, he will still be owed a full year's salary, which equates to £7.5 million. That figure reportedly makes him the fifth best-paid manager in England, behind his City and Liverpool counterparts Pep Guardiola and Jurgen Klopp, as well as Leicester boss Brendan Rodgers and Leeds manager Marcelo Bielsa. The hapless Norwegian was left apologising to the away end in front of a chorus of boos at Vicarage Road and now looks almost certain to be relieved of his duties following yet another big, unexpected defeat. Former midfielder Darren Fletcher, now a technical director at Old Trafford, and ex-team mate Michael Carrick, a first-team coach, would take over for United's next two matches against Villarreal and Chelsea until a permanent successor can be found. United's co-chairman Joel Glazer now reportedly wants a step to be taken in their pursuit of former Real Madrid boss Zinedine Zidane, while Fox's boss Rogers, who poured cold water on speculation ahead of the weekend, is also on the board's wish list. The former France midfielder won the Champions League on three occasions with the Spanish Giants as boss and is seen as the obvious replacement for Solskjaer. It was previously understood that the Frenchman had no desire to take the reins at Old Trafford during mid-season, though is now set to be greeted with a charm offensive as United look to bring him in. In further reports via The Sun, Solskjaer said his goodbyes to the players and Thierry staff members, with the inevitable axing now on the horizon. Solskjaer bid farewell to his staff and players following the brutal defeat with club chiefs to sack him within 48 hours of the final whistle. The Manchester Evening News also claimed that people in the United camp were in tears following the end result at Vicarage Road and that even the United players believe that the Norwegian will now be axed. The 48-year-old Norwegian has now won just four games in 13 and the collapse in form has been dramatic with the defeat at Vicarage Road following back-to-back -back home defeats to bitter rivals City and Liverpool. With the defeat at Vicarage Road, United have now lost four of their last five Premier League games, conceding 16 goals in the process, and have the worst defensive record of any team in the top 10. Solskjaer acknowledged the dismal run was a source of embarrassment for him and the players. The results are not good enough, we know that, he continued. We've gone 30 games unbeaten away from home, and now we've lost two on the bounce, and conceded four goals in both of them, so of course something's wrong. I feel for the fans and I feel the same as them, we're embarrassed by